Do you believe in life after death? What did I tell you at the beginning? I don't deal with belief. Okay, so... So it's about knowing. Do you, do you know about life after death? Of course. I'd like you to tell me about it. What would you like to know about it? Everything. <laughs> <laughs> do, you know why I say, do, you know, do you know why I say this? Yeah. I know because there's no death. Hmm? There's no death. Because your energy, right? Mm -hmm. Energy cannot be destroyed. But how it can be transformed. That's right. So that's how I know you don't die. You just transform from one state to another. So where do you believe that people go after, okay, after when they transition in? Right. If you like. Sure. Um, again, I don't believe because you have to deal with evidence and facts. And as I've already explained that energy transformed from one state to the other. No, but, so okay. I'm trying to, where do the yeah, spirit go? I'm, when try, I'm trying to answer yeah. the question. Okay. Right. So... Depending on how much you know about mm. energy, mm. energy has different density, right. or different levels, yeah? Mm. So the more dense things are, the more hard things are, right. that means they're slower in their vibration. And the higher the vibration, the more less dense they are, yeah? So when you transform from one state to another, you still exist, but in a different form. So for example, to make it clear, if you took ice, yeah. Ice is a more dense form of water, which is liquid, right? Mm. But then you can heat up liquid and it becomes steam. Mm. And that's changing from one form to the next to right. the next. And it ultimately goes back to mm. energy. Mm -hmm. So you as a being also are able to go through different realms mm -hmm. and exist on different realms where the physical body goes back to the ground and your spiritual body continues on and it lives in that realm as a spiritual being. You said before, like your ancestors are living in a spiritual no, but world. Where, do the, no, but where does the spirit go? That's what I'm trying mm. to explain to you. The spirits are just another level. Is there a hell? Is there heaven? You're asking me a lot of questions all at the same <laughs> time. Sorry. I'm trying to answer. <laughs> so as well as mm. the spiritual you, mm. if you have a soul, mm. you have a soul you, you have a mental being, you have an etheric being. These are different states of you mm. that exist on different realms. Mm. Even though you're connected to them at the same time, mm. your physical body being here is a lower vibration that has slowed down from the etheric realm to come here and you can go back the other way. And there are places, actual existence and places that are physical that you can go to as well beyond what you know as the planet Earth. Yeah, because this is also mentioned in the Bible, like Job 9.9, Amos 5.8, mm. um, where people refer to the places like Octorus, Orion, Sirius, and they say mm. these are the many mansions. Mm. So Jesus said, in my father's house, there are many mansions. Mm. These are the mansions. So these are actual places that you can go to if you know how. And when you basically translate, or as you <coughs> say, transition, if, you, if you're um, developed enough, you can go to these places and continue your existence. Okay, wait, wait. So, the, so that explains the song um, that we used to sing in church, um, especially at funerals. Um, something about, um, I'm going on right on, that's all I know. I'm going on right on to the city. Exactly. Where the mountains the city. are prepared for, or there for me, or something like that. Yeah, because the yeah. book of Revelation talks about a city okay. called what? Um, I can't remember on top of my head, but it makes sense now. Yeah. To an extent. Right, the crystal city is spoken right. about in the book of Revelation mm -hmm. as well. So again, this is another place that you can go to. But there are different places and without studying and like really researching, a lot of people don't know. They just, as I said, they'll believe and they sing songs, but they don't dissect them to break it down to, you know, make it make sense. So these different mansions, how many mansions are there? What, what kind of mansions are they? Like, you know what I mean? Yeah, so when I mentioned Job 9-9 mm. and they talk about Pleiades, they talk about Octorus, they talk about Orion, right. they talk about Sirius. These are what, do you know what those are? Mm -mm. Constellations. You know, when you look up into the stars, mm. you see different constellations, and there are literally millions, because there are billions of stars, and they are different constellations, 
they, they show you them in pictorial form. If you get a, a, a star map, you will see all of these constellations. Mm -hmm. And because the cosmos is so vast and it's constantly expanding, mm. it means that they, you can't literally count them. Wow. Yeah. Wow.